What up YouTube, it's your boy Jake here, aka Brushstrokes, and today I'm going to show you how I seal and protect my canvas paintings. So, just finished up this pet portrait here, and we're going to go ahead and get it sealed up. We're going to be using the Creos PS290 by Spray Gunner. This is an awesome little airbrush, it has a good 3-4 inch spray pattern on it with this fan cap. It also comes with a round cap as well too and what I use for my canvases I like using the Autoborn sealer transparent sealer the 6000 I really like this um, gives a nice sheen where it's not too glossy where you know you get reflections on it um, but and it does protect it very well as too and the nice thing about Autoborn sealer um, it does have like a dust I don't know I don't know if it's a dust repellent but dust does not seem to accumulate on the Autoborn sealer like it does on clear like other clear types of you know sealers and like a transparent base but I'm going to show you how awesome this gun is too because we're going to take this right out of the bottle not even reduce it and we're going to go ahead and spray this thing And show you I always test the brush first but I'll show you the spray pattern on this thing now we need a little bit more air of course I'm getting bottom heavy I didn't clean this thing very good so bear with me here a second So, just need to apply a couple coats of this. Probably should have set this upright somehow, but when I'm painting straight down like this, paint tends to lean forward, so I gotta keep it more topped off. Make sure you get all them edges there. Come back here in a couple minutes, in about 10 minutes, and we'll give it another coat. All right, ready for the second coat. I got this hung up on my easel here. So a little easier to get it sprayed. One thing with these, if you use Createx, it does get some dry tip. All you gotta do is pick it off the needle there. And just check your spray pattern. Good to go. Thank you. 
So I don't know how good you can see on camera, but. A big old fat spray pattern on this thing. Works out great. I'm going to cut you off, let this dry, and then we'll take it outside so you can see what kind of sheen that this Autoborn sealer has. Alright, here it is all finished up. You can kind of see the sheen on it here. Alright, well that's all I had for you all today. Till the next one. Keep those brushes stroking.